First question. 20 girls have a mean height of 155 centimeters. 15 boys have a mean height of 160 centimeters. Calculate the mean height of all 35 children. Well, let's look at the first sentence. To work out the total height of those 20 girls, just do 20 times 555. That gives you 3,100 centimeters. All right, same for the boys. Total height, 15 times 160. Right, I'm trying to work at the mean height of all 35 children. So I need to add up the total heights of these students. Right, that's the total height of those students. There are 35 children altogether, so I now need to do 5,500 divided by 35 pupils. That gives 157.1 centimeters. I've rounded that. So that's the mean height of all 35 children. Second question. At the end of five games, the mean score is 18 points. At the end of six games, so one extra game has been played. At the end of six games, the mean score has now gone down to 17 points per game. So we need to work out how many points did that team score in the sixth game. So first of all, work out the total of those five games. 5 times 18, uh, 90. Do the same for six games. Six times 17, 102. How many points did the team score in the sixth game? So what you do now, is you work at the difference between 102 and 90. Uh, 102, take away 90. That leaves you with 12. So it looks like the sixth game had uh, 12 points. Right, now the uh, third question. 100 students each did a maths test. The mean score for these 100 students is 7.2. There were 60 boys. The mean score for these 60 boys was 8.1. Calculate the mean score for the girls. Well, if there are 60 boys, obviously there are going to be 40 girls to make up the 100 students. Right, let's look at the second sentence. 100 students altogether multiplied by their mean, that's 720. A total score of 720 for all students, boys and girls. Right. Now let's have a look at the third sentence, third and fourth sentence, the third line. Now this is talking about boys. 60 boys with a mean score of 8.1. So their total score is 486. So that's for boys. Right, now for girls. Well, we know there's 40 girls multiplied by the mean but well, we don't know what it is. That's what we're trying to calculate. We're trying to calculate the mean. Right, the total score for the girls we can get just by comparing 720 with the 486. Right, the difference between 720 and 486, 720 take away 486, that leaves you with 
234. So the total score for the girls is 234. So now to work out this question mark, just do inverse operation, 234 divided by 40 gives you 5.85. So it looks like we've answered the question here. We've worked out the mean score for the girls as 5.85.